here's the auto level switch. So it's kind of like leveling out. If I get into a dive, like, oh, I'm out of control. Like, go to the sticks, hit the switch, and it just levels out. Okay, do it again. We go up a little bit higher here. Get into a spiral dive here. Uh, let go of the sticks. Pull the switch. Levels out. Let me do that again. I'm out of control. Let go of the sticks. Pull the switch. Just levels out. Out of control. Pull the switch. <laughs> That time I let go of the sticks, I had I still had throttle. See how it jerked right out of uh, wherever it was at? Did you get that one? Yep. Okay, let me try that again. A little bit less throttle. Coming down. Actually, sorry, the switch was still pushed on. You can fly in the 2D mode. It's just that you end up fighting the sticks. Every time you let go, it centers itself off. Okay, so the switch is off. I'm in the what's called 3D mode. So it's trying to, trying to just follow my sticks. Dive, 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 pull the switch, level off. Switch is off. We try to put the, the switch near the camera. So I'm in a dive, in a dive, in a dive. <laughs> pull the switch. <laughs> that was close, I was looking at the camera. <laughs> I have reinforced my wings because the first time I tried this and I showed it to somebody, I ripped the wings apart. I had the gains I was, set up. I was here. Point. Yeah, it was, <laughs> yeah, that's right. It was set up so strong that when it went into that dive, it just ripped the wings off. So, and you can you can see how it pulls. So far, the leveling is not perfect. Um, I think I've got some. I just got to configure it. Um, I pretty much took it out of the box wired it up and then just started flying it and uh, what I've mostly been flying in is the 3d mode where it's just trying to stabilize it and it works you know really good stabilizing it in the wind to keep it smooth but that 2d mode the self leveling you know wherever you're at you flip a switch and it just levels itself that's a that's, I mean that's a cool feature for if you like lose orientation you know you might be a little far away for your vision or something like that and uh, you just flip that switch, it's like a panic button. But the, the, the regular airplane stabilization features that I've tested on this is really good for a dedicated plane three-axis system. Instead of just using a helicopter gyro on one axis or trying to use several helicopter gyros, this thing is, is really nice for the amount of money that you're going to spend. my junker test platform <laughs> perfect cool thank you sir